Good morning, grandkids. Um, I think I'll just sit here and talk a bit. I don't have anything else to do. Um, I put up a blog again this morning, so you might want to go and read that and talk to me over there. Uh, I'll put a link to it, if I remember, <laughs> down below. <laughs> um, let me see. The weather is so beautiful outside, and I want to. I would have loved to have sat out there and uh, used my camera, my uh, my uh, phone camera, and uh, made a little vlog. But every time it's nice out there, and I want to go out, there's kids out there up, down, farther down the mall mall it's not a shopping center <laughs> but that place out there reminds me of a mall it's just a little center with the fountain and trees going down the length of the apartment building um <clears throat> it's everyone's patio areas anyway there's kids out there or s visiting people or they run over into this area from some projects around here and they drive me crazy. They they don't just they scream and yell. They can't play without screaming and yelling, and I can't stand it. So if I do take anything out there to do, like to write or to sit out there at my table and read, I have to just pick everything up and come back in and slam the door shut. <laughs> yes, I slam it shut. Sorry. Um Sometime in the soon future, the maintenance men are going to be coming over and taking these patio doors out and replacing them with new ones. They're already working on the ladies across the hall. So there's going to be a lot of racket and hammering and carrying on going on. So it's quiet right now. So I decided to make this video. I don't know what's going to happen when they take mine off because flies come in and wasps come in. They crawl under the doorways. So when they take those off, they're going to flood my apartment and it's going to drive me nuts. I wish they'd wait until I move. Oh well. Life goes on, doesn't it? What else did I want to say? Uh, oh, I'm glad that you all enjoyed that little video I made about the sad sentient tree. That was so fun to make. Maybe one of these days I'll make something else like that. At least it's something to do in Skyrim. <laughs> um, it, that, that was kind of fun. Um... Remember quite a while back when I showed you the sort of the beginning or talked about a story I want to write about a unseen but vaguely vaguely seen something up in the forest behind a small mountain village. <clears throat> I really want to get into that story, but I thought I'd be getting through with the young wizard Dorkly before now, but I just keep thinking up more things and it just keeps getting more involved and I can't leave it yet. So I'm having, I'm having fun writing that and enjoying it. So I'll just keep going till I come to some kind of place to stop him and then I'll start that other story. I am thinking of ideas for it and jotting notes and stuff like that so I'll be ready to start it when the time comes. And I hope you'll like it. Um, so I guess that's all I have to talk about today. Uh, I really I really 
would like for you to all start going over and uh, chatting with me on my blog. It's called Grandma's World of Skyrim. I'll, I'll leave a link down below and and people, most people seem to be getting on there and talking to me, okay? Some keep telling me that they can't. I don't know why. Uh, I suppose you have to subscribe to it. I don't know. It's a separate channel from this one. Yeah, from YouTube. And uh, so come over there and see what you have to do in order to get on there to talk to me. It's, it, I want it to be, I don't want high, love you, stuff like that. I want people to come on there and read what I've said and talk to me and it's a blog, okay? <laughs> so I hope I see some of you there. There's a, there's a few coming over there of my regulars and, uh. But I would like to see the rest of you there and enjoying it. So I will talk to you later. Um, it's such a beautiful day outside today. If the kids ever go away, I'll be out there on my, at my patio table. If they don't, I might walk over to Walgreens and just give me some ice cream or something. <laughs> I just have to do something outside. All right, grandkids, I will see you later. Uh, come back and talk to me. Talk to me. <laughs> Till next time. Bye-bye.